team, I've been doing my own thing, making my own moves. 24-7, 365. I wear what I want, say what I want, and I will not hesitate to do a spontaneous cartwheel if I feel so moved. <laughs> oh, crap! Not to brag, but being 13 means I'm officially a grown-up. At least according to the Toronto Transit Commission. Good for you. Am I right? Breakfast is ready. Mm. Yeah, no sugar. Coming. Mm. Porridge. Is it a fever? A stomach ache? Chills? Constipation? No. Wait, is it that? Did the did the red peony bloom? No. Maybe. <gasps> Four Tom's coming to Toronto. What? Ah! 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 Chill. May? Are you a werewolf? No! What? <laughs> He's a red panda! Sick. You're so fluffy! You're so fluffy! I've always wanted a tail. Priya, Abby, quit it! May, what the heck happened? It's just some, you know, inconvenient uh, genetic thingy I got from my mom. I mean, it'll go away. Eventually. Maybe. May 18th, they just announced it. The 18th? There's no way this will be gone by then. Just, just go, go become women without me. May, <laughs> it's gonna be okay. No, it, it's not. I'm, uh, I'm a freak. Just, just leave me alone. <laughs> connection with red pandas. Are you kidding me? This little quirk brought us in our family. Oh, oh. <laughs> you were so cute. Sick. I've always wanted a tail. I'm a freak. We love you, May. You're our girl. <sighs> Whoa. You're you. 
Any strong emotion yes! will release the panda. Abby, hit me. <gasps> oh! Do you know how dangerous this is? You'll get whipped up into a frenzy and panda all over. <laughs> I've been perfect little May May. Yeah! But maybe I like this new me. <laughs> Mama's girls. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> it's gonna be me. <laughs> writing a song has literally been the most fun we've had writing. Stuff. So I'm super excited to say that Billie Eilish and Phineas O'Connell are writing the music for Four Town. The glue that holds these characters together in Turning Red is this boy band called Four Town. Yes! Four Town! When we got approached about this project, we left at the opportunity. It's true. It was very exciting. Four Town forever! Never not on my mind songs in the style of early 2000s boy band. It's the yeah. really catchy melody and harmonies and claps and choreography. Phineas is actually going to be one of the members of Four Town. The main ingredient in these boy bands is like these young, heart throbby teens that kids fall in love with. Just Robert. Hey, yo, and Aaron T and Aaron Z are like really talented too. We wrote three songs. One that... The Confidence Booster. The Confidence Booster. booster. One that's more of a love ballad. Mon amour. And then one that is the hit song that everyone knows. Main and her friend's passion for Four Town, it really resonated with me just because I was the same. So accurate of how it feels when you're that kind of fan. Operation Four Town Shakedown is about to commence. There's just like this bond when you have people that feel the same. I just, I love the film. The impact that Pixar has on all humans. It's really kind of amazing to think about. I've been watching Pixar my entire life. Within the sort of treasure chest you put memories of your childhood in, Pixar films oh loom pretty large. To this day. They're incredibly entertaining and deep, and there's so much meaning behind them. You know, watching Turning Red. Besties, assemble! It really resonated with me. This is grade eight. I don't got time to mess around. The challenge we always set for ourselves at Pixar is we want it to feel like our films are grounded in stories that are specific and unique, ah! but also universal. What's going on, honey? I'm a gross red monster! <laughs> the goal is to have it be based in personal experience, and I don't know if Domi has come clean, but it's a little autobiographical, this story. The inspiration behind Turning Red comes from my own life growing up as a dorky Chinese-Canadian girl in Toronto, Canada. It really taps into that awkward, cringy time in all of our lives when we were 13, when everything in our lives were changing. Whoa, what is that? Some of the craziest moments in the film are based on things that have happened to Domi. <laughs> Except, of course, for the giant furry red panda. <laughs> I think Turning Red is universal. It's about finding your own voice and then accepting your own voice. We're bringing something new and different while also keeping with the Pixar tradition of great stories and great characters. My whole life I've been perfect little Mei Mei. But maybe I like this new me. 